every time I don't bring the egg basket, there are lots of eggs. Now how many do we have? One, three, two, three, eight, nine, ten. What comes after ten? Eleven. Eleven. Very good. We have eleven eggs. Almost a dozen. Welcome back everybody. Yes, there is still a Christmas tree behind me <laughs> with the Christmas ornaments on it. I'm probably going to be taking all my Christmas stuff down today. I don't know that I'll actually take the tree down. I am going to probably go ahead and pack up all the Christmas ornaments later this afternoon. Anyway, right now I'm finishing up my meal plan. We're going to be going to Aldi here in just a little bit. It's almost lunchtime now, but I think we're going to go to Aldi first and then we'll have lunch when we get back. Sissy and Manly are going to go with me. I'm just waiting on her to finish up her seat work before we leave. So we're going to go get everything we can from Aldi today, but I know I am going to have to do a Walmart delivery or pickup order. I think I might try delivery again. I've done it a couple of times since, you know, I had that time that they completely just like canceled my order for no reason. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure there was some kind of reason, but it said that my order was on the way, that it said the driver's name and everything, that they were on the way, and then suddenly it was canceled. So that's only happened one time, but for a long time I didn't do any more delivery orders because of that. And then over the holidays, I tried it a couple of times. I needed a few things, and so I just did a delivery order real quick and everything was good. So I think I'm gonna try another delivery order this week because I am still, as of right now, still a Walmart Plus member, and so it's free delivery. <laughs> but yeah, I have some stuff planned for this week, and I know all he's not gonna have everything I need for that stuff. So, gonna have to do a Walmart order. Also, I wanted to ask y'all, do you wanna see lots of slow cooker recipes? Because I have lots of slow cooker recipes. I put a couple of them on the meal plan for this week. An Italian chicken and a Southwest chicken tacos recipe. Then a leftovers night, an out night, and I'm leaving another night open because Titus normally finds something he wants to make or something he wants me to make. So I'm gonna leave one night empty for him to pick something. Oh wait, is Jacob's birthday gonna be before I go get groceries again? Yes. So I need to let Jacob pick that night. Unless he picks to go out to eat, then we'll make his birthday night the out night instead of Friday or Saturday. I also need to figure out what kind of cake he wants or if he wants a peanut butter pie. Sometimes he picks that instead of cake. Okay, I think I'm ready. So as soon as Cece gets finished, we'll be ready to go. You ready to go to Aldi? Do they get toys? Oh, uh, I think they probably do. Let's see what we got this week, Nene. We have a corner bath basket, $4,999. Two tier slide out organizer, $14.99. Portion perfect collapsible meal kit. Throw blankets, $14.99. Oh, they have a shelf, shelf kit for $19.99. Sit downs, yeah, the little stools are those sit downs. <laughs> Comforter. Are you already tired? Yeah. They have these pretty metal lanterns for $14.99. It's a two pack, it comes with two of them. Glass jar sets for $14.99. Shower curtain liner and shower curtains. Glass hydration water tracker bottle, $8.99. Oh, a coffee grinder and cup warmer. Only $4.99, y'all. And a milk frother. This is just like the things that used to come on the side of one of the Keurigs that would froth your milk. Is it only $4.99? It is, $4.99. A water filtration pitcher for $22.99. Imperfect baking dish, $12.99. Oh, look at this diffuser. It looks like a little wicker basket cover thing. That's cute. It's $19.99. They have these decorative ladders. I saw these in the ad, but I can't remember the price. Oh, $49.99. Single serve espresso machine. $59.99. Nutrition blender. You hear that I baby? I hear a baby quiet. Yeah. It's a little baby. Nutrition blender. It's marked down to $34.99. They have some three-in-one stick vacuums. I'm not sure how much they are or how they work, but they are really pretty colors. They have this blue one and purple. Those are pretty. All right, we have Tuscan Trail Mix. Let's deal with Tuscan. Sweet and spicy Cajun, Tuscan, or Asian. What's in the Asian? Rice crackers, peanuts, Japanese style peanuts, honey roasted peanuts, sesame sticks, wasabi peas, almonds, and chili crescents. This kind? Yeah. The yummy, yummy, and my tummy tum. Can they open them? Yummy. Wait till we pay them. Wait till we pay for them first. Let's see. 
that chocolate cake is still here. Every time she sees this cake, she's like, this is the same chocolate cake. Maybe I am a T-Rex. <laughs> People are scared of you. No, they're not scared of you. They have any new candles. Let's see, Tropical Escape, Vanilla, Rose Water. What is this one? Gardenia. What does that one smell like? That smells good. The sausage is only $2.29. They have some hot chicken fries for $9.99. That's a really big box. Sometimes waiting pays off. The Mad Minis are marked down to $3.29. <laughs> Raspberry or almond Kringles. It's like, is it like a Danish? Oh yeah, okay. It's a Danish. Almond or raspberry. The pizza made from chickpeas. We are back home now. I guess the first thing we need to discuss is why the Fox, they had Christmas and fall things, which I don't even know if I ever saw this Fox back in the fall, but they have it now and they are marked down lots of different fall things for only 99 cents that I'm sure are probably like normally five to eight dollars. This, like I said, I can't even remember them having this in the fall, but I'm sure it was at least, you know, anywhere from five to fifteen dollars. They were only a dollar ninety-nine. It stands up by itself and everything. It has a weighted bottom. She's gonna go down there into storage and she'll be happy to come out in October, November. That's all I got from the fall and Christmas clearance though. I did get one of the new Aldi finds this week, which was this boot and shoe tray. I have one of these that we keep outside on the back porch, but some of us bring our boots in and put them in the laundry room. So I wanted one to put in there. I think the one that I have now actually was in the laundry room at first. Then we moved it out to the back porch. So now we'll have one out there and one in the laundry room. All right, I got this pack of disinfectant wipes. It was only a little over $4 for this three pack. Got some dish detergent. I can't remember if I've ever tried the Aldi toilet tissue before, but this says compare to Scott and we were starting to run low. I usually get the really big pack from Walmart and it lasts us a while, uh, but I thought I'd give this a try this time because Walmart did go up on their price on there. So this was actually down a little bit. I think it was $7 for this 12 roll pack. And I got another one of these prep and go jars. This is like the one I put my strawberries in. And even when I don't have strawberries in it, we use it for lots of other things. So I got another one of those. Got two things of laundry detergent. This one is compared to Gain and this one is compared to Purex. All right, and then I didn't get any ground beef because I have a pretty good bit of ground beef in the freezer from when I bought that that was on sale at that other grocery store, the IGA store. I'm hoping that they have another sale on it next week. They don't have it going on this week. I looked last night. They do have a sale, but it's not, a, it's not you know, a super great one. So I'm hoping that they'll put ground beef on sale again before I have to buy it again. I did get some chicken. We got some mild sausage, uh, bacon. We're gonna have a sub night, so I got a sub kit. This just has turkey and ham in it. And I got this pack of ham here just for sandwiches and stuff throughout the week. I got two pounds of the hot sausage. The hot is our favorite. Um, and it's a really good price. It's only $2.29. Got some bologna, pepperoni. I got one box of pie crust. Some pot pies may be coming up this week or next week. I already have some in the other refrigerator in there. So I just got one box. We have some salsa. I got these hot chicken fries. I really think Tyler and Jonah will like these. They like spicy stuff like me. So I got that. It was $10, but it's a really big box. It's 3.5 pounds of hot chicken fries. And then I just got some regular chicken nuggets. These chicken salad singles were marked down. I guess they're just trying to hurry and sell them. They had this kind and the cranberry almond, but I just got the classic. It's probably what we're going to have for lunch today. Chicken salad croissants and the kids will probably want chicken nuggets. So I got one pack of butter, some vanilla wafers, two boxes of scalloped potatoes, and this double chocolate brownie mix. It looks really good and I thought this might be something that the boys want to make one evening as we know they've been enjoying making cookies and things like that. I did get some more peanut butter. Jake said he's going to show us how to make those peanut butter cookies that he made but they don't have Jif there so I just got this small thing of the Aldi, what is it, peanut delight kind and I'll get Jif on my Walmart order. I got the sweet and spicy Cajun trail mix. I thought this was the kind that the kids would like the most. Got some ranch seasoning mix and Italian. 
one block of mild cheddar because I have a lot of cheese in there. I just went ahead and got one more block of mild. Then for the sub night, I got sliced pepper jack, sliced Swiss, and Colby Jack, but the Swiss is also going to be, I think I might make some French dip sandwiches this week, so we'll use the Swiss for that too. Two cans of green beans. I just grabbed a couple to add to my green bean section down there. We got some pickles, traditional pasta sauce. I got this poppy seed dressing. I think I've tried poppy, no, I think I've tried raspberry poppy seed before. Anyway, it looks really good, so I'm going to try this poppy seed dressing. I also got some ranch, some ketchup, baked barbecue chips, and tortilla chips back there. Uh, cereal, we have a lot of cereal in the cabinet, but I did get some cocoa rice. I didn't have to get any sparkling water because Ingles is having a sale right now on the Waterloo for it's only $2.98. That is a great deal, y'all, but make sure if you go to Ingles to get it. I got a strawberry grape and uh, they already have the summer berry out, so I got that. But mine didn't ring up right, so if you go to Ingles to get that Waterloo sale, make sure it rings up correctly. Because whenever I first rang mine up, it came up the regular price of $5.98 instead of $2.98. Okay, I got some Old Fashioned Oats. I was running low on those. Some apple juice back there. Two gallons of milk. And I think everything else is produce besides the bread. We got these croissants. That's what I'm going to use for chicken salad sandwiches for lunch, two packs of tortilla shells, one medium, one large, and I just got one loaf of honey wheat bread. Oh, and some French bread over here. All right, and for produce, we got some yellow squash. I've been wanting a squash casserole, and they had a good price on it at Aldi this week, so that's going to be coming up one day. We got some lettuce, cucumbers, a bag of lemons, bag of these mini sweet peppers, slaw mix, and I got honey crisp apples this week. That's what's in this little bag right here. They are so pretty, y'all. Look at how pretty these apples are. So shiny. We also got a watermelon. Manly went with us, and of course, right when he saw that, he got very excited. I got these raspberry oranges, again, because like I told y'all, Jonah and Sissy especially love these things. So we got another bag of those. Got a cantaloupe. All their berries, like, well, besides strawberries, but blueberries, blackberries, and raspberries were all on sale. They were $1.99 for each one of these packs. Uh, kiwi also, only $1.99 for this pack. We got some grapes, 10-pound bag of potatoes back there, some celery, bananas, tomatoes, and carrots, and I think that's it. Oh, that's not it. Hold on, y'all. I almost forgot the Mad Minis. <laughs> These are so good, y'all. So yeah, they marked them down because it's after Christmas and they're peppermint flavored. So we got a couple of boxes of them. Oh, he's what? gonna eat it like an Oreo cookie. <laughs> All right, we'll get this stuff put up and it's lunch time. Manly's plate, y'all. Everybody's saying that the spicy ones are very spicy. I'm about to try one. They have hot on that box for a reason. Those are those are those are super spicy. You need lots of ranch to dip it in. You want some ranch? They're good, but very spicy. Here you go, Manny. These are good, not spicy. 